Hey, how you doing? I just want to talk quickly about gang stalking, the usual subject. And I'd like to talk about how these people not only like wreck your life, they're not just after you physically, mentally, but they also want to take your soul. And, um, you know, they also want for you not to see God. They also deny you of any spiritual uh, ev evolution or spiritual uplifting, let you see the most high. Um, they want to stop you from seeing God himself. These people are that desperate, you know, that they've turned into demons. Um, you know, it's like everywhere you go, people's souls, people's spirits have been snatched from their body. And, you know, they put it inside a computer or, you know, they, um, you know, they steal the person's soul some way, somewhere and damn it to hell or, you know, the soul goes to hell or something like that because, you know, these people have like demons inside them the way they carry on. The way these people behave is very much like they've got a demon inside them, something from the Exorcist movie that you see um they act very demonic in behavior you know every day i get tortured i get followed around by invisible people these invisible people are like ghosts right and you know they're trying for me not to see god they're trying to snatch my spirit from my body these people are like trying to kill me and you know my parents are even are in on it my family's in on it my friends they're all being taken over. It's like a, their spirit has been taken out of their body and they're being manipulated like pawns and puppets to do whatever these gang stalkers bid them to do. They, um, they're that brainwashed that they'll do anything these gang stalkers tell them pretty much and believe it. Um, they'll make up any story about you just to break you down as an individual, just to try to discredit you and try to humiliate you, force you to commit suicide, um, try for you to kill yourself, anything. So there's a way that they can damn your soul, you know. Um, they want you to commit crimes. They want you to do all kinds of nefarious, dark things so that you can basically, like, forfeit your, your life, forfeit your soul. They'll... They're only looking for a reason to take you out. If you're a TI out there, they're only looking for a reason to take you out. They want you to try to go out and lash out, break the law, commit a violent act, you know, like a school shooting, movie shooting, whatever, you know, like, you know, they're all for that. They don't give a damn about these people. All they care about is people's souls, people's spirits. And um, they want everyone to turn into like a criminal so that they can like basically snatch your soul from your body, snatch your spirit. Um, try that's They don't just try to break you down physically, mentally. You know, they, they also, they try to break you down spiritually and they tell you you're not seeing God or, you know, um, you know, that basically like um, they control everything, you know, in the world. And um, everyone is manipulated in this gang stalking program. And, you know, it's like they've got a soul catching machine, you know, along with their invisibility um, devices, um, you know, that they also have, you know. And, um, you know, these people are hitting me with frequencies, they're assaulting me and things, you know, like. And, you know, they're calling me ungrateful and it's really, really twisted, sick, dark shit, you know, like the things that I could describe, like, you know, they don't want to let me stand up, you know, um, I did something wrong to their rock spider hood, I did something wrong to the monster hood, um, you know, actor hood and things like that, like these people sort of tell me these things and the reason why they want to snatch my soul my spirit from my body and things like that these people are like demons you know they come after your spirit as well 
They come after your spirit. They come after everything in your life. And they break you down financially, physically, mentally, spiritually. Like all those things they're able to do. And they're saying that there's no future in this world to me. You know, these people, these invisible people tell me that, look, there's no future. There's no future. And, you know, I'm starting to believe those kind of things because everyone, everyone's been taken over. Like everyone behaves like different now. You know, they're all suspect of each other. Everyone sort of like is playing this role, is playing these sort of roles, you know, like very much like agents are, you know, and they go around the community and stalk people or whatever, you know, and they have taken over the world and they say there's no future for people, you know, but only God knows basically is what's going on if you believe in God, if you believe in a higher power. And that's all that can save us from this misery that we're going through this. And they've created this this world where people are just become demonic. And, you know, only, you know, we've just hopefully the watchers, the angels, you know, um, higher beings, you know, evolved beings can see what's going on with our world and try to help us because human beings have lost their way um, to this gang stalking, to this monsterhood program. And, you know, we need to be directed to the light. When human beings need to be shown to the light, we need to bring love back into this world. Otherwise, there is no future. And with that being said, take care.